Okay. Okay, this is my other world again. This is number two. You guess who that is, huh? That's your Uncle Bill. And, uh, of course, he's got three pugs. And the only thing I don't have on this is the chain. I got a mom help me pick out some jewelry chain. And, um, anyway, uh, when this one moves, and, and as, to act as leashes. Okay? When this one moves, only the dogs move. Okay? And I made it with a smaller type blade. And it's a two bearing machine, now that I know how to make them straight. And this one I just used wire to come up through and to the dogs. I didn't have too many problems with this one. I did have the problem with the dogs hitting one another. But I solved that by putting spacers between the dogs. But uh, I'll give you a little bit closer up on it. This one didn't take too long to make. You know, uh, and um, it's a kind of a unique way that I hook the dogs in here. Um, I put a little screw eye in the back of their foot. I took a Dremel and I made a slot. So the screw eye, eye, will get down into the bottom. And this is a nail, and they're pinned. Each dog is pinned. And then I have to link each one to the front. That was about the only problem I had. I'm going to bring you up closer so you can get a better look at it. Okay, I try not to jiggle the camera too much. But as you can see, I come in there, there's the nail, and the screw eye sits right in, screwed up this way into the back of the foot. And so, anyway, when you turn this thing, you can see the pugs moving up and down. This one works really nice. This is a, of course, you can see Uncle Bill. If you can see them, I mean, what, and this is kind of a unique thing we did. Um, what I did is I go, went through my old photos that I took of uh, digital photos that I took at various gatherings. And I found a photo with Billy holding a cup of coffee. Okay? So I printed that out on my printer. And then I have a, um, a uh, what do they call it, a projector. And I put the picture on this projector and projected it on the wall in the basement. And I moved the projector in and out until I got the right size that I wanted. And I traced it out. So I got his, his basic body shape. He even kind of looks like Bill when you look at him. If you remember your Uncle Bill, he's kind of chubby. And uh, my, the back in here, just I mean, if he sees this, he's going to know that's him. I mean, anybody who looks at it and have seen him will know that that's Bill. So that turned out pretty good. And I went on the Internet, and I found a picture of a pug's. And that's what I did for the pugs. I did the same thing. I printed it out, and then um, and then uh, I traced them out, and we drew them. I uh, cut them out of, out of uh, plywood, and sealed everything. I've, yeah, everything's got about four coats of paint on it, because once you seal it white, then you go over with a dark color, and it just doesn't want to cover. You have to keep going over and over and over. So anyway, that's a uh, that's a uh, whirly gig. Number two. Okay, in just a moment I'll bring you three.